the name's Ricky Spanish. Ricky Spanish. They call me that on YouTube because of how many people like me. It seems like just a week ago, I was sitting right here on this comfy couch talking about my UV5R and exposing the lies that many ham radio operators have been spreading on YouTube. And a lot of people got upset about that video. A lot of butts were hurt. Some people were upset because of the strange relationship that I seem to share with my UV5R. The antenna's off. It's like it's naked. Other people were upset because I exposed the lies that so many ham radio operators have been spreading on YouTube and the internet about the UV5R. So I wanna take a minute to respond to those people if I hurt your feelings or made you feel sad from the bottom of my heart, I don't care. If you're getting yourself upset and worked up over what some YouTube hobo says on his YouTube channel, you're doing it wrong. So now you're probably gonna get even more upset when I prove to you that this is the best radio that you can buy. Now first, let's be clear. Let's get this out of the way right up front. This is a ham radio. It's not legal to use for anything but on ham bands and frequencies, or if you have a business license, there's some business frequencies you can use it on. It's not legal for GMRS. It's not legal for FRS. It is not legal for MERS. You don't need to post a 14 paragraph long comment explaining all the laws and the constitution and radio theory, pointing out that it's not legal to use in many cases. We got it. If you want to learn more about the legalities of using the UV5R and who says you'll go to jail if you use it, check out. But before I can tell you why this is the best radio, we need to understand what best radio means. Because what best radio means to me may not be the same as what it means to you. And it most certainly doesn't mean to the average normal person what it means to an elite ham radio operator. For most normal people who just want a radio to play with and talk to somebody else, the best means the cheapest. And by that parameter, at as low as $23, this is the best radio. You can find these on Amazon from $23 to $40. For most people, that's all they care about. Case closed, best radio right there. This radio also has great performance on a per dollar basis. Now, some people will point out that it's got cheap circuitry, it's got a squelch that barely works, it has spurious RF output, but in the real world, for most normal people who just want to use this to talk to somebody else on their hiking group or in their 4x4 group, they don't care about that. Spurious RF output is the furthest thing from their mind. Most of us don't even know what it means. You don't need to post the comment because we don't care. What most normal people care about is that when they push this button and say words into it, their friend at the other end, half a mile away, hears what they say. This radio does that, does it for 23 bucks. This is the best radio for them. It's a scanner. You can listen to and scan through just about every frequency there is. You can listen to the astronauts in the International Space Station on this. Can your fancy ham radio do that? Oh, it can? Can it do it for 23 bucks? Didn't think so. The Baofeng UV5R, although made of plastic and cheap circuitry, is surprisingly rugged. I've dropped this one a few times. It still works. And if it didn't work, guess what? I would not care. Because it was only 23 bucks, I'll order another one. Let's see you drop your $600 ICOM if you ever actually go outside to go hiking or off-roading. If you drop it, how upset are you gonna be? Most normal people that actually go outdoors into the sunshine, would be stupid to get a $600 ham radio and take it out there with them where there's a good chance they're gonna drop it and break it. These things are pretty much disposable. It's the best radio you can buy. It's also easy to use. It's got a lot of buttons, and at first glance they can be confusing, but in 10 minutes on YouTube, any moron can figure out how to use one of these. Punch in the frequency. Tell your friend over there to punch in the same frequency. Push the button on the side. Say words into it. Guy over there hears you, it works. Best radio you can buy. And finally, the most important reason why this is the best radio on the market, 
And the one that should matter most to you elite ham radio operators is because this little radio is probably responsible for bringing in more new ham radio operators into the hobby than any other radio. This radio is like a drug. It pulls them in, gets them interested in ham radio. And despite the stupid, mean, elitist comments that so many basement-dwelling ham operators post on YouTube comments and the internet in general, people still get interested in the hobby. Now, don't get me wrong. I've been accused of being a hamophobe, an anti-hamite. I love ham radio operators. Some of my best friends are ham operators. I once dated a girl in college that was studying to be a ham radio operator. But what nobody likes are elitist dickheads sitting in their basement trolling YouTube and Facebook and internet forums, talking down to people that aren't as smart as them, trying to make themselves look smarter than everybody else when they just make themselves look like dickheads in the process. So it's all these reasons that normal people love this radio. It's the same reasons that so many of those elitist ham radio operators hate this radio. But those elitist ham radio operators just don't seem to get that what's best for them may not be best for another person. It's really that simple. Best radio you can buy. If you disagree, leave a comment below. If you're an elitist ham radio operator, try to do it in less than 15 paragraphs. Let's make it so us normal people can understand it. If you love this radio also, leave a comment and tell me why. If you hate it, I don't care, but leave a comment and let other people know why you hate it. What's so horrible about this radio? Why the hate? Leave a comment below, explain it for us normal people to understand. Thank you for watching. Hope to see you on the trip.